Hi guys, welcome back to Flex5101. My name is Esteban and today I want to talk about manual cutting rules. Online you can check out the manual cutting rules chart which is going to help you further understand what we want to talk about today. So basically we want to determine at what lengths to cut our pipes. This is determined by understanding your overall dimensions and for instance today we're looking at an overall external dimension of 12 inches. At 12 inches our pipe at the length is going to be 8 inches. Why? Because we need to remove 2 inches from this side and 2 inches from this other side. And this is going to give us an overall of 12 inches. If we look at it in a different configuration, in this particular one, now we see that we have 12 inches in total and our pipe is also 12 inches in length because the way that it ends at the end of a joint set. And finally, we have this configuration here, which you can see that we have a total length of 12 again, and our pipe length is 10 inches. So in this case, we're only removing two inches from one side, and the pipe is ending flush on the other side. That's when you wanna make external dimensions and overall dimensions. When you're looking for perhaps a supporting pipe, and you're looking at an internal dimension, then you're gonna wanna measure from pipe to pipe on the inside of each pipe, and from there remove three quarters of an inch from each side that you're gonna be attaching that inferior pipe. So that's it for today. Have a look at the chart at our website, and I'll see you next time.